Hey everyone, welcome back to Super Mario Sunshine. Now, if you spray these M's, you'll just magically teleport into their world. And this world is Bianco Hills. Now, episode one, Roll to the Big Windmill. You actually don't have to do this. You can. What you can do is you can is you can actually beat the polluted piranha, and then go up to fix PD Piranha on top of that windmill. Which that's exactly what we're gonna do. Because I just learned a cup about um, an, a month ago, apparently, just before this LP, that you don't have to, that to beat the game, you don't, that, uh, M, you don't have to uh, defeat Road to the, uh, you do not have to defeat this polluted piranha in episode one of Bianco Hills to beat the game. So we're not going to be doing that because polluted piranhas are just so overused in this. Uh, Polluted piranhas are used the most in this. That's why, like, they're so annoying to not only me, but, like, everyone out there. Everyone out there that plays Super Mario Sunshine, you got to admit that they use polluted piranhas way too much in this game. Way too much. Like, why can't you think of another boss? It'll probably take you, like, five seconds to think of a boss as rigged as this. But anyways. Two, two, three, one. E, Z. Now, okay, hold on. Now it's gonna be terraforming once again. You're probably thinking before, how the heck are we gonna not get a how the heck are we gonna get up there? Well, as I said in the last episode, terraform. Anyways, don't get the shine sprite. If you want to do this in the least amount of shine sprites as possible, do not collect that shine sprite. You can if you want to, but then you'll get teleported back. But I'd rather just do this really quickly. Okay. Okay. Whoa, I got so lucky there. Oh, okay, now that was unlucky. Anyways, go over there to get a, some extra of that. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh. Now this guy will actually say, hey, aren't you getting ahead of yourself? But no, we're not, because we're trying to do this as fast as we can, and I just missed that, damn it. Okay, we're going to be waiting here for a while. So let me explain how PD Piranha is going to work. He is actually pretty recycled in the later games. But PD Piranha, he's not really that hard. I think the best strategy is to move or remove all the mud, but that takes a bit too long. All you got to do is just spray it. Brown pound on him, which is um L, I believe. But anyways, here we go. And this is actually kind of funny. Your roar is more ultimate than mine. You're ten times bigger than me. For that, you must die. And also because you look like a really weird flower. Okay, that was the weirdest sound effect my brother just did this whole life. But anyways, yes, and yes, that was my brother. Anyways, round, 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 round. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah, he'll. Ah, I hate when he does this. I hate when he does this. Oh, and he also do this really weird attack. Um. Oh, you're so fat. You're gonna, you're gonna die. Are you gonna shoot? Are you gonna shoot some spread out? I'm you gotta be kidding me! I, I, you know what? From now on, screw you. Get out of here. Okay, nice. There we go. Don't worry about a bit of mud. Just if he spews out a bunch of mud. Somehow, that small. I don't understand how he spews up that much mud when he's kind of small in his stomach. And oh, damn it, I have to clean this up, don't I? I'm actually not that good at this one in particular fight for some reason. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, that's it. I'm had it. No more mud. I'm gonna do this. Spraying it into his mouth, spraying it at his cheek. That is epic. Yeah! And my bro's still doing the sound effect for some reason. Anyways, uh, let's see if we can 
Come on, spew, 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 Yes. I'd say the best ways to do it is kick jump by running, running the other way and jumping. Um, yeah, that's it. And even though he turns into mud, he still comes back in a, in a couple more levels. Okay. But anyways. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was the weirdest thing ever. But anyways, I'm so bad at doing this. I'm so bad at getting this right at the end. I just always keep missing for some reason. But anyways, shine! We did that accidentally in the lead four sweep. No more of that. Anyways, let's now go quickly on to our next level. Please tell me we have enough time to do this. There's, oh my god. I don't know if we're going to have enough time to do this. But anyways, the hillside cave secret. Slide, 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 jump. Then, no. Why? What a waste of water. Jump, jump. Oh yeah. Right, I for almost forgot. I actually, I actually, I don't worry, I know what you're supposed to do, but I accidentally went that way for some reason. What you're supposed to do, is, oh crap, do I have enough water? I don't. Oh, yeah! I did it! Okay. That's not even the way you're supposed to do it, but anyways, go over here. And inside here. Okay, please, now this is a floodless mission. Now, every single time the mission's name has the word secret in it, that means it's a floodless level. This is actually the easiest one, but I might fail on this a bit. So sorry if I fail on this at all, because this is actually a very, very easy level, and I might accidentally make it seem horribly hard. But let's try to not fall down. <laughs> now the best part is, if you die outside of a floodless level, you have to go back and restart the mission. But thankfully... They're nice enough in these flightless levels, knowing that it, and saying that, okay, if you die, we're gonna still allow you to go back to this place because it's really, really friggin' hard. And I thank Nintendo for that. I really thank them. Because without. Dang it. Yeah, this might take me a while. Sorry, guys. This is gonna probably take me a while. So hopefully I can get the Shine Sprite before the video's done. But, I don't know, because I'm actually pretty bad at this in particular level. I don't know, I'm just bad at Bianca Hills in general. Oh, why did I press A? Did you just hear that sound? Or did you see my reflection from the screen? Yeah, I just slapped my head on how stupid that was. Oh great, I only have one. I, I have actually no lives left. Even though it says zero lives, or maybe I'm just undead. I don't know. What about you? Yes, made it. Okay, now this is going to be much easier now. I'm going to make this way quicker. Okay, please tell me I'm not going to actually die like that. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was too funny. Right before the start, too. God, oh, this is too funny. See you guys then. See you guys next time. Sorry, that was just way too funny.